Inlinks is a new breed of SEO tool. This modern web technology allows SEO specialists to create optimized content that Google truly understands. Your sites can have machine readable content with automated schema and internal links management. Inlinks does this by first creating knowledge graphs. That's kind of encyclopedias or dictionaries of every fragment of content, as well as those of your competitors for any given phrase. We can do this using a sophisticated NLP algorithm combined with our own proprietary knowledge base, probably one of the biggest knowledge bases in the world outside Google and Bing. We can then inform your content writing by understanding topics that are semantically close to your target keywords. This means that Google better understands the page content and sends better visitors who are more likely to convert. But we also do more than just creating content. From the page level building block, Inlinks builds out a knowledge graph of all the content on your site. Inlinks is able to automatically add internal links to the content to better connect those topics throughout the site. And finally, Inlinks automates web page schema so that Google can easily update its own knowledge graph with your content using industry standard JSON LD schema code. Inlinks will help you create better web content with meaning that Google can understand because Inlinks has built out a, a massive knowledge base of its own. In these video lessons, we'll look at how Inlinks builds schema and internal links. But before that, I'll show you how the powerful methodology Inlinks uses to help you create original, awesome and machine readable content will immediately challenge and trump the competitions. Inlinks is great for content optimization. Let's say you want to create some new content around the phrase Galaxy Z Flip or Galaxy Z Flip. You don't have to have a page already to create content. What we're going to do here is create a content brief. So what the Galaxy, uh, what, what Inlinks is going to do now is go and find out what pages are already the most important around the phrase Galaxy Z Flip. This analysis can take a few minutes to complete. You can go back later if you want to. When the analysis is complete, you can get a content brief for the phrase Galaxy Z Flip. And you know that you need to talk about concepts like the Samsung Galaxy, Samsung smartphone, but you also have other concepts, foldable, clamshell, film, other products like the Motorola Razr, which was a flip phone, many years ago. It will look and understand all of the topics that you should be talking about. And it shows uh, this by understanding uh, what is already ranking within the search engines. So for example, um, this AndroidAuthority.com page is talking about the concept of the Samsung Galaxy Z Flip, and it's talking about Samsung foldable masses, Galaxy S20, etc. So you have a pretty good idea of the kind of things that are already ranking for these particular phrase. We also work out how many words these sites are using on average and the kind of main topics that are, that are usually there. That allows us to come up with suggested keywords that you might want to use. And these keywords are connected to uh, topics and ideas. The content structure is also there for the editor to start using so that they can understand what they want to write about. And if there are questions that have been found, then we will list these there as well. So you can get ahead and you can start to write some content. You can either do that by associating it with a public URL that you have already put on your site, or you can use our content editor and cut and paste. We're going to put some content in here now. So here I've written some content within the WYSIWYG editor around the Galaxy Z Flip and written an article with H1 tags. And I can save this text and then I can update my analysis and I can see how the content that I have written compares to the content that is already ranking for the top phrases around for the top sites around Galaxy Z Flip.
And we can see that we've currently got a score of only 27%. So we probably need to do some more work if we expect to have this content treated with the respect it deserves by Google. And this is because although we've talked about some 49 different topics, we haven't really talked about some of the main concepts within there. For example, we've not talked about the concept of clamshell. What is clamshell? Well, we can have a look and pick that information up. And this will go to Wikipedia. And actually, this is talking about the concept of topic of laptop because um, the Galaxy Z Flip is a foldable phone uh, like the old Motorola razors um, and other similar uh, things such as laptops. So perhaps we need to talk about that in our content. And if we do so, then it's going to help Google understand that this is not only topically close to the concept of the Galaxy Z Flip, but it's also going to allow Google to then see that you have authoritative content that covers all of the bases um, around the Galaxy Z Flip. And we know this because we've looked at the other sites that are here. Um, and uh, we can then, once we've done that, either update our content or we can export this information so we can give it to an editor or a content writer so that they can take this information and improve upon it.